IntelliTrack Inventory Shipping, Receiving, Picking, also referred to as ISRP, is designed for a small to mid-sized warehouse. ISRP automates your order fulfillment process. ISRP is able to do this because it contains four fully integrated functions. They are Inventory, Shipping, Receiving, and Picking. Use ISRP Inventory to perform inventory functions including scheduled physical inventory counts, cycle counts, inventory adjustments, and inventory moves. Use ISRP Shipping to validate order details, generate shipping labels and packing lists, and export shipped order and carrier information to billing. Use ISRP Receiving to receive stock via receiving orders. Use ISRP Picking to validate item location and quantity when fulfilling a warehouse pick order. IntelliTrack ISRP maintains a complete history of application activity. The application tracks each transaction by date and time to the logged in user. With history logging, you know where your inventory is, who has control over it, and when it was added to the system. In IntelliTrack ISRP, data validation is ongoing. Use ISRP to maintain your inventory, perform physical and cycle counts of your inventory, and fulfill receiving and picking orders. Use the tabs and ribbons to navigate through the application and open an application form. When a form is open, it appears in the work area. If multiple forms are open, they appear in the work area in a tabbed structure, and you can easily move between them by clicking on the form tab. The forms are intuitive to use. Enter data by keyboard entry, a wedge scanner, or drop-down selections where available. The process buttons along the bottom right of the form are used to add, save, or process data. You will notice that these buttons are often used in the course of this demo as we work with ISRP. You always go to the process buttons to perform a function in ISRP, whether it be clicking the Do It button to process a transaction such as an inventory move, clicking the Add button to add data such as items, sites, and inventory, clicking the Save button to save a record, the Print button to print a record, or the Close button to close a form.